we have some of Australia's foremost entrepreneurs with us uh, to share their knowledge, to share their ideas, and, and to share their expertise. important for MYB to be part of the Shop Small event with American Express is because we also believe in supporting small businesses, um, making sure that they're successful, we want to make their business life easier and so we want to be part of this great movement. A small retailers certainly add to the vibrancy of our communities. They bring much needed investment to our shopping precincts and much needed employment to our towns and our cities. Now, technology can really uh, make a small business compete on even terms with a, a much, much larger organisation. Whatever you do, make sure that you're ready for this next generation of users. By end of this year, there will be more people using internet on a mobile device as compared to a desktop computer. I think Shop Small should be a, an annual event and I think November is the perfect time in the lead up to Christmas and when everyone's out there shopping and obviously you know want to support their local services. So I think it's a, it's a perfect time and a great initiative from Amex. Great for communicating with uh, people of like mind. Finding out a lot of new things about technology. It's been fantastic learning lots of tips about um, branding, marketing, increasing sales. I think small business is going to get a lot out of these events. We've seen today people have come from so far away to participate. I'm so pleased to be part of it and I can see not only are they learning, but they're also being inspired. To get the best people in the best roles to that business, you always find that they'll really take the business for you and if you've got that passion from the top of the business it actually filters down to the staff. The thing that kind of brings us all into this room is a passion for what we're doing. And I remember Lorna Jane who's the founder of the, the Gym Gear um, chain saying that if anyone talks to me about work-life balance I know that they haven't found something that they're overwhelmingly passionate about. If you really love what you do there's not such a distinction. Our minds must always be in the clouds but our feet always on the ground. We should always dream.